We're here today with an electric fat trike and we're going to go over some of the basics of the battery, the battery charger, and turning the screen off and on. One function of the battery is that you can remove it. Uh, for easy removal, you'll flip up the lever on the back of the seat and that'll pivot the seat forward. The key has three positions. Right now we've got the battery on and locked in place. As you turn it counterclockwise, now it's turned off so you can't use it, but the battery is still locked. At this point you can remove the key if you wanted to, so you can leave the trike locked while you run into a store. If you put the key back in, you can turn it one more position counterclockwise by pushing in and turning, and now it's off and unlocked. Turn it all the way if you will, John and we'll be able to slide the battery out if we want to. Flip up the handle, pull it out, it'll slide all the way off. And you'll notice one thing, when we put it back in, the contacts are down on the bottom. So when we slide the battery in, it'll rest in place and then you give it one more little push to seat on the contacts. Now we're gonna turn it back on because it's off and locked. So we turn it one position without pushing in. We turn it once more and now it's on and locked. We know it's on and locked because we can use the panel here by pressing the button. You can see the battery status light up. If we just push the seat down, the seat will lock in place. Now with it on, we can turn on the screen if we want to by pressing and holding the M button for three seconds. And the screen is on, the pedal assist and throttle will respond. If we give it just a little bit of juice, it'll go. We turn the screen back off again by holding the M button for three seconds, and let's look at the charger. The charger here is currently plugged into the wall. The green light is blinking on and off. It's got a three pin XLR plug, and that plugs in here under this panel that pushes to the side. And you just line up the pins and push it in all the way. No turning, nothing weird. When it's pushed in, the light turns red and it's going to stay red until the battery's fully charged and then go green. If we look at this plug again, when we're done, we just pull it straight out. And close the panel and we're all set. 